Many, many artists have this, that they don't want to release their pain and their problems because they think that makes them creative. And maybe, maybe it does, maybe it does. I ask myself what's more important, to be a successful musician or to be happy? So I want to be happy, you know, definitely. And, and if I need to, I feel I have to stop doing this, I, I, I will do it. Even, you know, when I don't have a job, I don't have money, but you know, life is a mystery, you never know. like four years ago and I was at a point where I didn't want to do it anymore you know I was serving the people and played what I thought was right and, uh, and I got this feeling oh, I want to quit I don't want this anymore I don't know I felt like a little bit like prostitute you know and uh, at this point I thought oh fuck it you know I just I just play whatever I, li I like most my own tracks I played a lot of my own tracks and uh, didn't look for new music all the time. I just played what I loved and, and the funny thing was that the re response from the crowd was amazing. Everybody was telling me, oh my God, I've never heard such great sets for a long time. So and then the light switched on. <laughs> and it's a bit, I feel a little bit isolated, to be honest, you know, in this job. I mean, it's uh, beautiful to connect with the people and play the music, but, you know, I mean, when the party is over, the people go home, I, I go home and sit alone in my car and, uh, yeah, and it's also hard to, you know, to, to find a good girlfriend in this scene, you know, I mean, they're young, on drugs, whatever. Now you don't know if they are doing it for you or for... Uh... That's also the thing, you know, of course, when people come towards you, you never know why. Because you're a DJ, yeah. yeah.